WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. Monday, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, first Monday of the new year, kicking things off and markets starting in negative territory. A little bit of ge geopolitical risk carrying over over the last 72 hours from Friday. Right there, you get Dow futures off 189 points. That's almost 7 tenths percent, trading 28,413. S&P futures down 20 points. That's about 6 tenths percent. Trading 3216 Nasdaq futures off 62 points or seven tenths in the red, trading 87.48. Oil trading higher, gold trading higher. We'll start things off. We'll start it off with the VIX this morning. As you would expect, fear, volatility priced into this market. VIX spiking to 1639 overnight, 1572 this morning, looking for the open. A far cry from where we were even Friday in the low 13s. We'll jump over to the charts. We'll start things off with the indices. We'll start it off with the Nasdaq 100. 87.50 right now in that index. You back things up to Friday. We're up there as high as 88.56. Excuse me, Sunday night, the futures open. We're pretty much right where we at when we opened on those futures last evening. S&P, Friday, we made it as high as 32.46. You back things up for some perspective. Before the strike on the Iranian general, the S&Ps were reaching an all-time high of 32. 63. We're now trading at 32.18. You had made a low in the S&Ps as low as about 32.08, just shy of 4 a.m. this morning. Dow 30, 28,426. Pretty much just under the level that we opened at on the futures last night at 28,512. Crude oil, quite an acceleration to higher prices. Last night you had crude trading up to $64.71, currently just under the $64 price level at 63.87. Gold catching quite a bid last night as gold, the futures open. We trade to a high of 1584. Check out that number in the price of February gold. Just under that level right now, you have gold trading at 1576. And the euro US dollar trading just under 112. Euro trading 111.99. In terms of what else you have happening out there, it's a lot of talk about the geopolitics going on between the US and Iran. You had President Trump. Tweeting over the weekend, threatening a retaliation if Iran had retaliated. And then you also have the House setting to vote to limit Trump's military powers regarding Iran. Pretty heightened tensions as we escalate into a Monday morning. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Larry Pesavento coming up live right now with Trade What You See. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Fast Market by TD Ameritrade, Thinkorswim at 11. Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back.